Hey everybody, welcome. I'm Garrett. And I'm Carolyn. And we're Diary of a Family. And we're living life intentionally with you live. Live. Woo! Woo! Welcome, welcome everybody. I see we have a lot of people that already joined us. I know, you guys have been having a party without us. Well, we've been busy setting up here, getting ready. we got a lot going on right now. Can you tell my hair is not, not perfect? <laughs> not welcome. Best. We want to celebrate the D-Fam tonight. So that's what we're doing. We're celebrating our 1,000 subscribers. 1,000, 1,000. Our 1,000 D-Fam. We are so thankful for all of you that have decided to join us on our adventure. And hopefully we can help you guys enrich your life as well. Okay, let's see who's on tonight. Sh shout out Mel Nettie, living free, zip codeless, so, living light RV. Our National Adventure is on. Extraordinary Journey, nursing our travel bug. Um, shout, out, shout out a couple no more. No Ordinary Path is here. Yep. Uh, let's see. We have Jerry Holly. Welcome, everybody. Hello, hello. Kent Peterson is on. Of course. Hi, Kent Barbara Peterson. Barbara Carter is on. Nursing our travel bug. We RV said underway, that. I see. Happy place camping, Papa Drew. Papa Drew's RV. All right, Bubba. All right. Um, Buckeye oh, Kitty. Well, Buckeye welcome. Kitty. Avengers. Welcome. Avenger RV, Avengers here. Imagine your Odyssey. Welcome, everybody. RV. RV Kids is here. Kid, RV Kids TV. Awesome. Yep. Um, and then Mr. Roboto, 2338, just subscribed, I guess. Mr. Roboto. <laughs> All right, so we have a lot of people. Um, bear with us if we don't get to your comment or chat. We'll do we our best. will get to it as soon as we can. And we'll try and keep on top of it as well. Well, you guys, we want to give some special shout outs to quite a number of channels and people who have been supporting us this last year or two as we have fought for this big 1000 behind us. Um, so first off, we want to shout out Kent and Lisa of Living Light RV because really, without them, we might try to give up. Yeah. But they are really heart and soul behind us, and uh, we really appreciate that. They encouraged them. us to find our why, and that really That's, helped define our channel. Yes. The reason why we are here as Diary of a Family, um, living life intentionally, we discovered that after they encouraged us to look for that why we do what we do. X marks a spot asked doing some cooking tonight. Yes, you got it. Do we want to show them? Yeah, go ahead. Avocados. <laughs> we want to shout out Richard and Hope uh, of, of X marks the spot. They have truly become grandparents for our kiddos on the yes. road. And they are also travel nurses. So it's very helpful to know that we have... Um, you know, just such strong people that we can rely on and um, yes. that we look forward to meeting on the road again. Yep. Hopefully, we'll you'll do a contract together for sure. Yeah. Uh, next is Allison and Andrew from Our National Adventure. They have been such an inspiration for us. I mean, they, like, we didn't know half these national parks existed until you guys showed it to us oh my gosh they are exploring everywhere those nooks and crannies that you will want to go and see because of just the beauty of it all and the fact that they're doing it with their three little girls um we are super excited to meet them on the road again yeah. as, as well but um it's it's been great to do this nomadic and online lifestyle with them yeah i'm um, also jerry and kelly galleon from galleon adventures they have been such a fun support for us as well. Yes, they have been. Uh, half the time, if he's on the phone, it's either with his mom or with Jerry. I'm like, you guys yeah. are best buds. Why are you on the phone with him all the time? But they're chatting back and forth about <laughs> YouTube and this and that. and It's good for him. Yes. All right. Next then time. we're going to shout out Bill and Natasha from Nursing Our Travel Bug because they're just cool. Yes. <laughs> um, if you didn't know... Um, Bill is a stand-in for the Wookiees on Star Wars, so, you know, but they did a really cool video on a uh, really cool stepladder recently. I ha highly suggest you go check that out, and um, it's lightweight. It works really well for RVs, so definitely consider that and go check their channel out as well. 
we're shouting them out because they're just really special people. Again, Bill, uh, Bill has become a best buddy for Garrett, even though they've never met in person. Uh, with Bill being a stay-at-home parent and, and caring for the kids and doing their homeschooling, it's just like Garrett has, I don't know, a counterpart. Yep. But we're hoping very soon to meet them in person. That should be pretty soon. And then we're going to shout out one of our newer ones, Mel and Nettie from Mel, uh, Mel and Nettie Living Free Zip Code List. And breath. And breath, yes. <laughs> <laughs> they are a pretty awesome couple that we want to get to know uh, more uh, closely in the future. We're hoping to get them on an interview so you can get to know them more as well. Yep. Um, next is Bob and Sharon Childers from... Uh, oh, sorry, my brain just... From, from the Nomadic, from nomadic, nomadic Ramblers. Nomadic Ramblers. So these two have been really a blessing for us when yes. we were actually financially a little bit constrained. Ah, uh, there they go. Oh, Thank you, Mel and Nettie, for the super <laughs> chat. Thank you so much. <laughs> Nine ninety nine. They are our number one fan. <laughs> Thank you again. And um, yeah, the we actually got to see the Childers recently trailer when we were in courtside. Holy it cow. It is so cute, you guys. They it's took a it, house inside. Took it down to bare studs and rebuilt it the way they wanted it. And it seems a lot bigger than how long and wide it is. And yep. it's built perfectly. She even does canning in there and sewing. They have, she has enough room for they canning have, and sewing. She has a normal refrigerator, uh-huh. a normal stove, yep. and a uh, stackable uh, washer-dryer combo. That's not yep. RV. It's all normal. I'd say their their bathroom's a little tiny. Garrett the bathroom is tall, but... small. <laughs> and then finally, if our special guest is ready to appear, we're gonna shout out John and Kristen from No Ordinary Path. Kristen's gonna come over here. If you can you slide slide through there. Our setup is kind of funky here, and I'm gonna show places. Right. Awesome. Slide in there. Hello, hello. For those of you who don't know, this is Kristen from. Um, no ordinary path. <laughs> My brain is just all over the place. It's all Sorry. good. It's all good. <laughs> we were trying to get John to join us as well, but he, as all travel nurses do, seem to work a lot. Yeah. yeah. They have yeah. like opposite schedules too. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if you guys have been off on the same day yet. No. no um, <laughs> on like, like the first day, on the first day or so. Yeah. So, and, yeah. I, and we've been trying to get you guys together so we could do like a live interview. Yes. But it fun. might have to be like some day after he works or some day after I work. Yeah. And that's going to be yeah. kind of late for us. I know. But late. we'll have to do it. We'll, do, we'll just have to do it. Because yeah. uh, are you guys leaving on Wednesday? We talked about leaving on Wednesday. Leaving on Wednesday. We can, are, are you working Wednesday? Yeah, I work Tuesday, yeah. Wednesday, okay. Thursday. Okay. So See, I was like, maybe tomorrow we is it. talk before we head out. But. Tomorrow is it. Yeah. If he has Tuesday off, maybe he he'll stay up late tomorrow night and we can yeah. just do it then. Yeah. Okay, no, cool. All right, we figured out our, our, our plans. Now. Stay tuned. Stay it's tuned. coming. <laughs> Well, you guys, those are our super shout-outs to everybody. What we're going to do next is, before we do our giveaway, we're going to make guacamole! I, you guys invited me on, like, a good night. I know. I know. I know. Guacamole? Garrett's guacamole is, like, fantastic. So, Garrett, I'm going to have awesome. you take over the whole okay. doing the guacamole stuff, and I will go ahead and take over this part, which I never do. <laughs> I'm on the computer tonight, you guys. Okay. Maybe we should trade, and I'll just do the guacamole, and you, you do wanna, the computer. If you want to do that, that's fine. <laughs> it doesn't matter to me. I mean, the ingredients it, are the ingredients. It won't be yours, though. Okay, it's we can not switch. mine anyways. It's up to you. It's, <laughs> Go ahead it's Jack switch. White's. <clears throat> I'm going to move the chair there. It's not my recipe. Yeah. It's Jack White's recipe so from his over. retainer. You'll have to be out of the... Out of the picture. Like this that. is so cool. I, I'm not used to the live thing, so I'm trying to read comments. <laughs> I, I'll Garrett bring up will comments. read, the, read the whole comment. Bring out. all the comments out. Who, who commented and what they said? If it's really good, we want to be able to. Like, we're not going to be paying attention. So yeah. you got yes. to read it for us. Yeah. We okay. will put this recipe probably in the description or at least a link to it so that you can. Yeah. Or, um, or just do it yourself. So what we have is some very ripe avocados. We probably need about six largest ones. Two, four, six. We've got eight. I'm sure yeah. we'll have plenty. We have a full um, bundle of 
cilantro. We've got four-ish Roma tomatoes. Looks like four and a half. Four and yeah, because these yeah. are extra from, from hamburgers last night. Yeah. Uh, we have a sweet onion that we're going to chop up, a couple of limes, a couple of serrano peppers, and you mix it all together and taste it, add salt and pepper, which oh, we, we have it out it's here. Salt, salt and pepper, pepper to taste. So I have the most important job. I get to taste yes. it. Yes. yes. I'm yes. so excited. Yes. Okay. <laughs> so if you want to grab that knife, we'll go ahead and get started yeah. with these avocados and just, awesome. yeah, let's Let's dive in here. And Garrett, um, if we have some dead space, we have yeah. some great things to talk about <laughs> as well. I got all prepared so that we could multitask. Yeah. Awesome. So we are we are hitting the road on Friday and we haven't really said a whole lot about what we're doing. Yep. <laughs> um, what we're doing while we are where we are heading and what we're doing while we're laying on the road. Yeah. Going down. So we are I'll heading. You if you need it. Our okay. final goal is Athens, Texas. Athens, Texas. We'll yes. be there for about a month, but then we are actually going to be hitting up a bunch of okay. cool national parks on our way there, including White Sands and Carlsbad. We're going to go to Tombstone. So Tombstone is going to be first on our way. I'm excited oh, to go exciting. back. I'm excited. Yes. We went to Tombstone like almost n nine years ago and really? it was really cool we didn't see do that last year that was one of the things we missed yeah carolyn's like i want to do one of the carriage rides well because so, we didn't yeah. last time yes. and emma's in love with horses and i thought well we could all do it as a family it's something that we could do yeah. sorry kent we're not going to canada oh. it's too cold oh no joke that would be fun though <laughs> yes some summer we're gonna get up to canada yeah yeah we we will be but that's the problem some, Carolyn would be getting a much needed break. She's been working way too hard. Way too hard lately. So way I'm gonna hard. be doing some work while I'm there, some work camping. You wanna share what you're some... doing or are you not allowed to talk about it? Well you don't know. <laughs> I told them I was I was willing to go and change Ooh, that looks rotten. Um that's why I got six of them. Or eight of them. <laughs> eight of them. Um, <laughs> I, yeah. I can count. <laughs> I told him I was willing to change trash and do all that kind of stuff. And he's like, no, kind of we have something else in mind. Um, like, uh, yeah. So he, his video videography skills are going be, to be in use. Yes. Ooh, yeah. Fun. Yeah. Yep. Videography and probably some editing. So the place, the RV park that we're staying at is um, associated with the RVTA, which is the RV Training Academy. And it is a nationally accredited training academy for RV techs. Um, what's really cool is that that um, that academy has courses from beginner RVs. Mm -hmm. It's like a one-week course beginner where they'll tell well, they'll tell you how to do maintenance and how to figure out problems yourself, which is pretty awesome. But then you can go and there's a um, you can do an RV inspector course. So you can become certified to inspect to RVs and before, get paid for to do that before yep. purchase. And then yep. you can take the six-week course and become a nationally accredited certified RV tech. And that's the and longest one. That's what. That's a month and a half course. Yes, we will send you some of this gook in the mail, <laughs> Mel and Eddie. I I got it. Promises. No, no promises. No promises. I think, I think, yeah. I love guacamole. John's going to love it when he gets back and he's hungry from his shift and he's right? going to be like, what? <laughs> Sweet. All right. So that's what we're going to be doing. And then we are going to a town that most people haven't been to probably called Douglas to visit some friends. Douglas, um, I've Arizona. I've been, I was, I was stationed there or yeah. had a temporary duty there for a couple months way, way back. Okay. And we avocados. made some really good friends. Avocados. N not ripe, not ripe, not ripe. Use me now! It's exactly. too late. <laughs> too late. Yeah, pretty much. I mean, I don't know if we can use any of that. This side, maybe. I mean, I feel like that's a metaphor for potty training. Mm -hmm. It is! It <laughs> is! Oh, we, had, we had one of those today, for sure. Oh my gosh! Okay, see if you can dig that guy Avocado! Out. The other side, I don't think so. And this one is really squishy, so I think we've... This one is, like, really too late. Yeah, I'm gonna cut it so open just like, oh, yeah, so yeah. Finicky. It's it's That's... pretty, it's pretty juicy. It always makes me so mad when I buy like a ton. I know because they're really expensive. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. I okay. Mean, yeah. Are we making guacamole? Guacamole. Yes. Guacamole. Okay, sing it, Garrett. G U A C A M O L E. 
Guacamole. <laughs> it's, awesome. and, it's a Rhett and Link. Rhett and Link from uh, the internet, of course. Okay, so yeah. we're going to chop up our Roma tomatoes. Um, I like them small-ish. Yeah. Uh, do you want like a, something to wipe? Yeah. I yeah was like, that's I what that towel wipe. is for. Because I knew we wouldn't gotcha. have water. Need yeah. some margaritas <laughs> with this. <laughs> oh, yeah. Darn, no. we forgot our margaritas. Margaritas would have been awesome. You want to start chopping oh, these yeah. tomatoes up, and I'll look into um, this onion prepping it here. I wish I had my second cutting board out, but I used it for chicken tonight. Ooh, yeah. Yes, so, it is a metaphor. It was super yummy, too. Did you like that? I did like sure. it. What? What, what about potty okay. training? At No Ordinary okay. Path, a metaphor for potty training. Yes. <laughs> From for Living sure. Light RV. Yes. Yes. Ooh, this we're, is a nice We're show. telling you, Kit and Lisa, yeah. <laughs> you want to meet John and Kristen. For um, sure. Yes, I know. I want to meet them so bad. Use scissors to cut the cilantro. It's easier. Oh, scissors? Yes, that's how I cut it. Oh, what you a good idea. You put it in a smaller bowl, uh -huh. and you just like peel the leaves off, and then uh -huh. you just go... Ch -ch 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 Excuse me, I'm reaching through a zero in our... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so how, how much do you want these? Oh, that scissors. Great. Okay. That scissors. Great. Nobody make fun of how I'm chopping <laughs> No, you're doing just fine. You're doing awesome. <laughs> Yeah, give Eddie a chocolate chip. No, he didn't get. Well, he got some chocolate like chips today. Before. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to our unofficial cooking show. Yes, right? unofficially official. chopping up onions and tomatoes and everything. What can else. we make tomorrow? We should. We can I don't know. On our channel and Ooh. make something. That would be really oh, fun. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We're up for anything a, you decide. A sure. collab. We're a up collab. for a collab. Yes. <laughs> If you want to teach them how to make something like, as you know, we're boondocking, so how do you make such yeah. a thing? We did chocolate chip cookies on our barbecue once. Did you? We did. Did they turn out? Yeah. The first batch was burned. I mean, even burned. if they were just a goofy mess, I'm sure The first batch, the bottom was burned, and then we figured out how to do it without burning them. Yeah. But Pastor's Living asked, are we serving coconut curry chicken tonight? We did, actually. Yes. We did. It was super tasty. It was my first time trying it. It's so funny, we keep making it, and we're like, <laughs> kids are like, we're doing it again? The kids are sick like, of it now. But everybody there signature. has not tried it. Everybody there yeah. has not tried it. And it was a Sm potluck, so our kids didn't have to eat it. They smell a vision. Yeah, I know, we need smell a vision. That's situation right there. I know, yeah. Yes, we will send all this um, onions through to onions. you Onions, I'm about ready to cry. You know what the trick is? Do you know what the trick <laughs> is? To do it underwater? Uh-uh, just stick your tongue out. I'm not kidding. I'm not trying to make you look silly. Yeah, you know what? It works. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I get it. No, for real. Actually, I, I, was, I was making a joke about it, but for real, if you stick your tongue out, you won't Does cry. it, like, catch the oils? I do it the all the time. Like, oils? Yes, yeah, something it like that. It catches the oils? Like, oh, you can also, like, set, like, a cup of water out, but whoever mm. thinks of that, like, it's so right. much easier to stick your tongue out. <laughs> but my kids make fun of me, for real. They're like, well, uh, I'll chop awesome. an onion okay, again. Okay, so like, that was uh -huh. a pretty big onion. Garrett, would <laughs> yeah. you put the entire onion in, or... Would you only... Because it was a pretty big onion. Um, I think it was... Um, Shall we I've just normally put it in done and half, look? but I've also normally done a smaller batch. Here. So oh, that yeah. should be... We're going to do all okay. tomatoes. I wasn't yeah. sure. Yeah. That should be fine. Um, so Life of Mind asked if we'll be in Athens. Yes, we, we will. Are. We'll be there we're for a whole month, Athens Stephen, today. so feel free to come and join us. Yes, we're going to be in send Athens. Send us a message and we'll uh, let you know where we're at. We're not going to say any more about that. I'm sure that people could probably figure out where we're going to be. But... <laughs> Milanetti said you're spitting on my avocado. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. I didn't mean to this spit. This is crazy. Okay, Garrett, yes on more onion? No on more onion. No on more onion. No on more onion. I like onion, you guys. I love onion. We can always try it out, and if we don't like oh, it, we want to add some oh. more. Are you okay? Woo! Oh, too much onion? No, it's coming. It's coming. It, it's My eyes coming. are starting to water, and i got to stop waiting. If you have leftovers, friend. we'll be right. Grassroots <laughs> Living, we do have leftover. Yeah. Um, you could probably be here in a couple hours if you haven't left uh, yeah. Yeah. Arizona. Yeah. Grassroots Living. Another Kim one of our Peterson suspicions. said, leftover guacamole is bad chalane. <laughs> <laughs> no leftover guacamole. Okay. Garrett, you want both these serranos put in there? Um, no take, seeds. Take the seeds out. Okay. It, it makes it not as spicy. And I hate the fact that I'm going to be doing this without gloves and there's no water to wash with oh, because no. then I'm sure I'm going to get it like on my Yeah, I don't think something. the tongue trick works on no. jalapenos or whatever no. they are, sorry. Uh, so they're serranos. <laughs> uh, spicier than jalapenos, right? They are spicy, really? yes. Right. Yes. You guys are so fancy. <laughs> well, you know. I think he made them with 
Um, I've done it with the ha- jalapenos normally. And, it, and it, yeah. it didn't work out wasn't very like well. Spicy it, wasn't, it wasn't nice enough. Jer- so. Jurgen, have a good night. He good said, night, uh, I can't eat this late. Oh. So I better okay. go. Okay. Congratulations. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> good night. <laughs> Welcome to Mike and MJ's RV Adventures. Oh, hi, guys. Windows. We're kind of hanging out a little bit. We want to see if more people on our. Uh, more people come onto the live stream that are signed up for our giveaway. Giveaway in just a few minutes. Do we want to tell them how many? We got 26 entries. We have 26 entries for our giveaway, and our giveaway is hiding in the background. So if you can, if you have that eagle eye, let us know where you think that the giveaway is. <laughs> oh, it's, it's, it's over. It's on the other side. Oh, it's on the other side of me. Yes, that, that's what I, I meant to do. Yeah. <laughs> she, I thought she meant to hide them uh. so that nobody could see them. <laughs> I was trying to give him a sneak peek. A sneak peek. So I also saw a little bit earlier that uh, um, traveling down the banisters just got monetized. Hey, you guys! Congratulations! Congratulations. Yep, I saw that that video. That was great. I think they did champagne online. Oh, on on their live stream, they pop champagne. All you guys in your live streams, I think we are missing out. It is. It's a lot of fun. With you guys already being monetized, a live stream would just ramp up your your watch time for sure. I mean, it's just like our real life is kind of crazy. It is. And so. This is not a normal live stream. So, I mean, it's cra- crazy. It's crazy. Us- okay. I mean, all of our kids are currently outside in the running dark. around outside in the dark. Yeah. <laughs> Except my three year old. He's in bed asleep. Yeah. Well, there's like a big campfire going on next yeah. door. There's like six of us, six families, six, yes. maybe seven. Yeah. Six, yeah. So six they're, six they're okay. They're safe. Yeah, they're, they're all playing with stuff other kids. To do. And you know what? Let's go ahead. They'll be, they'll as be as I went out there and there's like a whole there's, there's a card table. Oh, there's good. some people playing cards or some people around the campfire. And then there's kids on bikes. That's what we're gonna do when we're done here. We're gonna go back out to the campfire. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Kids on bikes. They're gonna crash into. I something. know. They're probably my kids. <laughs> <laughs> on my bike because I know. Aaron popped his tires. Today. Oh no! So then he got on my bike and I was like, please don't hurt my tires. Well, <laughs> Emma, we can't keep her since since Texas. Yeah. We can't keep her tire inflated, and he's even like changed the inner oh, tube, no. and, and then he changed the outer part, and it's still it it does not it does not chop. Oh. Two do donations. Wanna, we are making do you do guacamole. Your, your, your special. We're, here? I'm making guacamole, yeah. and if you don't Can't know you why us? we're making guacamole, check out our New Year's Eve live stream. You will know why we made guacamole. Avocado faces. Avocado faces. <laughs> Avocado faces. So, so um, for those of you that went onto Instagram and yep. uh, and commented so that you could get entered to win our giveaway, yeah. I was giving everybody a little avocado to tell them that they had been entered to win. Nice. Yes. It was so much fun. We might even make it into a t-shirt that you guys can buy. Yeah. interested in that. I think it would be really good. Avocados cute. are so fun. Yeah. I want an avocado shirt. I do. So that's the plan. A t-shirt. Yeah. But I think what we're going to make first is uh, hats, because we wear hats all the time. And I yes. want I want Diary of a Family logo right there. Yes. Yeah. I, I, think we're, I think we're going up towards hats. But I think we're, we're looking at setting up a, a store, online store, so that people it's could go. It's probably not going to happen for a while, guys. So don't even listen to yeah. him right now. He's just blabbing. <laughs> we'll, we'll announce it officially. We'll announce like, it officially when it's time. I know, I know. We want to. We're dreaming. It's like we're at a thousand now. What are we yeah, supposed not, to do next? Yeah, What's that was next our main step? goal for like yeah. years. <laughs> now we have to have a new goal. Yeah, totally. We're gonna try and get it done right. So it might take a little bit of time, but yes, we'll definitely want to do it the right way. So here's a funny thing that I I learned on some fancy cooking show on Netflix, something like that, is that I've been told that. The stem actually has the most flavor in it. Isn't what? that funny? And we use the leaves. As I'm stripping all of the leaves and we, off. No, no, don't even worry about it. Because we use the leaves, right? And then we just toss the stems. But I've been yeah. told, I, I heard on a show somewhere from some chef, that the flavor is all in the stems. Well, you know, if it was going to go into some kind of, like, Thai dish or something mm-hmm. with, like, you know, the uh, bean sprouts or mm-hmm. slaw or something in it, that would totally make sense. Because then it wouldn't, like, the texture yeah. wouldn't be weird. Right. But in in this, this it needs to be I think a the softer texture. Would be texture. Weird. Yeah. <laughs> okay, what are you laughing at? Oh, um, Living Light RV said, I think avocado shirt would go well with my Dorito socks. Yes! Ah, 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 yeah, Papa Drew did a really fun giveaway at our get, at our get together uh-huh. at, uh, at Quartzite. Quartzite. And one of, one of the, the most of the giveaways were socks. 
Oh, how funny. They, they're like Dorito socks. socks. They were like... <laughs> so. uh, my, my number was not lucky. I, I put in my, my age. We, I signed us up under my age, and it didn't win anything from Papa Drew. Oh. So, oh well. Better luck next time. That sounds like a lot of fun. I feel like I have a lot of video catching up to do right now. <laughs> <laughs> Don't we all, though? Yeah. I mean, there's been some, some great content put out recently. Absolutely. And meetups are super fun, but then you're always kind of like trying to be with the people that you're meeting up with, yeah. but yeah. also trying to keep up with your channel at the same time. Yeah. It can get a little... I know. <laughs> I, 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 and does John help you at all with the channel, like keeping up with the comments? And, um, and yeah. Such? Oh, yeah. He, he definitely He's keeps on up there with lot. like comments and email, especially because I'm terrible at email. So I'm very sorry if you guys have ever emailed me and I haven't responded. <laughs> <laughs> I just forget to look. <laughs> okay, it's getting really spicy over here. Woo! Woo, yeah. Really spicy over here. I'm so, trying to chop them really, really fast. Yeah. I kind of want my big knife, but I don't know where oh it is. Oh, my gosh. This smells so good. I love cilantro. I'm over here chopping finally with this itty bitty knife. When Just I don't do pop this. her a thousand. Words. Oh, that would be oh, really yeah. funny. Yeah. That would be very eventful. Yes. <laughs> to eat Bang. or to wear. So I'm curious mm. if any of your viewers uh -huh. hate cilantro because it feels oh, like yeah. there's a lot of people that either love, love cilantro it or hate it. Or hate it. And I've been told that there's actually like a, a certain gene that makes you taste soap instead of yeah. cilantro taste. Yeah, I don't. I've never <laughs> tasted soap. I apparently don't have that gene. I love cilantro. Yes. So <laughs> I, I absolutely hated cilantro and and um, coconut when I was a kid. Like they would oh, make yeah. me wretch and need to and want to vomit. Really? Like that that strong of a. And so I stayed away from those two things. And then as I got older, I realized, ooh, I like this taste. And it was cilantro in a really good pico de gallo in mm. Mexico. Wow. And I was like, oh, this is really good. <laughs> we got, okay, we're getting, I've gotten lots of, three. I don't lots know of comments. cilantro you guys Three for so cilantro, cilantro, three hate, two hate it. Oh, yeah, they're voting now. Voting awesome. now? Okay. So it's one of those don't things you either eye, love Carolyn. it or hate it. Yeah. Uh, don't, don't rub your eye, Carolyn. I won't rub my eye. No <laughs> rub my eye. Use the scissors. I'm focused. We're using the scissors. Yep. Scissors are so awesome. This is awesome. This is the best way this is to great. do cilantro. So most people don't know that this meetup that we have was originally just supposed to be like us and like one other family. Yeah. yeah. And it ends up being like six or seven families. It was, and and we've so had fun. a family yeah. come and then we've had go. a family go and another one come. Yeah. And so it's been really fun and the kids have just been enjoying Oh, my kids are having a heyday. I know. I know. Yeah. Are I mean, they getting any schoolwork done? Um, sort of. <laughs> sort of. <laughs> sort. I mean, we celebrated 100 days on Friday. Uh-huh. But I feel like the last five of their hundred days were like mediocre. <laughs> but Kinda. we still celebrated. You know, you're getting a lot of free play, um, yeah. free play learning happening right now. So that's good. That's good. <laughs> but I mean, we took them on that that huge. Um, yeah, the STEM event. The STEM oh, event was, was awesome. awesome. Connect to STEM event at um, the University of Arizona. Um, and it was awesome. from, we got there right as it was opening at 10. It was awesome. Yeah, and they like, closed it down. And yeah. we, we were there until after 3. when from they when had, they opened like, they to were, when they closed. It was yeah, so I thought fun. it was open until 4. That's why I was like, oh, I think we have a half hour left in us. And then they, like, announced it was closing. And I was like, oh. I got, I got a witness <laughs> brain surgery in 3D. I wanted to do that, but I had Edison, and yeah. there was no way that I was gonna try to hold on to this three-year-old who's exhausted because it's three o'clock. Yeah, and That's try to sit and, ex yeah. and 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 see this brain surgery in VR. So yeah. I'm less like. I let Garrett and Emma and Timothy do it, and Timothy, like, yanked his goggles off, like, within the first five, ten minutes. Oh, no. He's like, I don't like, I don't like brain surgery. Okay, do you want to start the lime juice yeah, over the top of absolutely. that? Absolutely. Um, and then I'm going to go wash my hands so I don't get spicy things in Oh, yeah. Right. Good call. Is that a cilantro, or do you think we need more? That's fine. <laughs> he's like, that's a lot of cilantro. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> do you want some cilantro, some guacamole with that cilantro? <laughs> yeah. Okay, wait. Am I doing this right? Um, Norma's the other way. This way. So push it down. There you go. I know how to do this. So, this is fancy. I just buy, like, the bottles. The bottle? Just juice. square yeah. it. Yeah. Normally, I mean, for just wanting to do it, not wanting to do it, like, right. Yeah. Well, just, I'll just have it and just, just squirt the you just squirt lime it, yeah. juice on there. Oh, my gosh. We have, like, 30 people on, so we nice. are doing they well. All wanna, they all want to join for the giveaway they're like hurry up finish that <laughs> finish that guacamole well, so that we can do this giveaway the party okay. can start now 
Mary Lou Gabrowski has she Hey! Hi, Mary Lou! Welcome! Welcome! We have you on the list! You Mel and are... said, more the better with cilantro. I am, ooh, oh, yeah. Oh, yes. You cannot have too much Absolutely. cilantro. Absolutely. Can't have too much cilantro in there. I'm getting up the courage to make it with ghost chili peppers. Oh, wow. And he will be eating with... that all by himself. Yeah, it will be <laughs> spicy guacamole. He, he will eat that all by himself. So I'm going to try to clean up just a tad here. Because I'm a clean-up freak. I know you guys are all wanting us to do the giveaway, and we will be doing that soon. Very soon. But After we, we wanted to do dinner. something fun and chatting with you guys. And now you can go and try it yourself. Yeah. Oops. Nice. And if you guys really wanted one of our stickers, and if you don't win one of our prizes. <laughs> Which will include um, a sticker. You can email us at rvdiaryofafamily at gmail.com. And just send us your address, and we'll get you a uh, sticker. So All right, I'm going get to uh, get rid of this completely over here. So, awesome. that is something that you guys can do. I love that you have, like, all the space. I know. I didn't I know. think that I would like an island, but I this is really nice. It, it's a lot yeah. nicer. Uh, it allows me to say, get out of my kitchen. And they know they're not supposed to, yeah. like, come behind the bar. <laughs> The, they the still island. do it. Yeah, <laughs> but when but I take it's out of the hard. Kitchen, it just means go outside. Go outside. <laughs> go outside. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Okay. Um. So we need to stir this and add salt and pepper salt to, and pepper te te to taste. taste. So we're gonna need a couple of extra Chips. spoons. We tried okay. some ghost chili, pe ghost pepper so chocolate when we were in Texas over Christmas. It was very tasty. Ooh. Ooh, Travels with the wing. Enough? I think there's a Ooh. few onions. There's a few nice big ones. <laughs> Here, let's use our scissors. Yeah, there you what go. What was what was that? Uh, um, I thought was it, it a ghost them. pepper? Um, they might break apart still. You think so? You know how, like, okay, go for it. The uh, um, beef jerky. Ghost pepper beef jerky. Yeah. Was that the one we got? Mm -hmm. Okay, so we tried ghost pepper beef jerky, and that was a little spicy. It, but it's hard to tell how much it was so in there. So all the hot peppers, like right on that edge, you'll want to make make sure that gets mixed in really good. So that you only have a little bite here and there. Yeah. yeah travels oh, with the Lenny so tried ghost pepper chocolate when they were in mm. Texas over oh, Christmas. Oh, wow. I can, like, that pepper is making my eyes water. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Stick your tongue out again. <laughs> Spicy. Oh, people think I'm so over John it. should be off shift now. Mary yeah, Lou Gabrowski, sure we, are, we are making guacamole. And I think you have probably watched our live stream from. New Year's. New Year's Eve. New Year's Eve. And the only reason why you're not seeing avocado faces is because we're not using the app that we used when we went live on that video. Otherwise, we would be wearing them the entire time we made this. It's hot. <laughs> Guac. Guacamole. Okay. All right. So, pepper and salt and pepper to taste. And I am liberal with my pepper. Go ahead. Let's see what we do here. Yes, we will. Right, we will put this. We will put this in the description. I will go write it all out for you guys, so that it's you can good. actually. That's good. I could teach you guys how to do like my perfect rice. Yes. Yeah. Oh, that nice. goes really well with Mexican food. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> all right, that's all right. for you. That's for me. Oh my gosh! I wipe my hands. <laughs> okay, you got to get a little it bit of everything. It was amazing. I would never have. I'm going to be the one that gets, like, a whole bite full of hot pepper. Oh, no, don't do that. <laughs> well, our National Venture tried ghost pepper chocolate ice cream Ooh, in Zion. Ice cream. They said Hello, it was our amazing. National Adventure, Allison. Yeah. Oops, I'm making a mess. And Andrew, right? Mm -hmm. Andrew and Allison. Oh, I just double stood. <laughs> <That's okay. laughs> mm. Totally fine. It me. was so good, I was like, I'm just going to have Garrett, some more. I think it needs a little bit more salt. Yeah, I've tried. Yeah, I think so. I'm of course, the chips are with the salt. chips. Chips are pretty salty too, so that mm -hmm. helps to eat it with the chip. <laughs> and that's an idea too. I'm gonna just do more pepper. You don't have to ask me twice. So I'll definitely take a chip. <laughs> <laughs> it's the last of the bag. I was like, oh, we should have got chips today. But I was like, no, I think there's enough in there for one bowl. Yeah. Definitely. Okay. I mean, you can. You can almost yes. Eat this better one, late really than like never. Salad. Who's there? Who's there? Skip Delarue just joined. Hello, sweet guys. That's why we decided to uh, make this so that everyone that joined might be joining late mm -hmm. will have a chance to join us. Mm -hmm. So we just finished our guacamole. There? I'm also That's kind really of good. missing our the lime. I was gonna say I think it like maybe a little bit more lime. Garrett, will you grab the lime juice out of the refrigerator? 
I think maybe the other yeah. limes were a little bit small or not as juicy as they normally are. I'm not sure <laughs> I really got all of the juice out of them. <laughs> it's okay. I tried. <laughs> it should be right there. <laughs> yeah. Or do I like that zing, that little bit of... Yeah. Yeah, this is my style. So. <laughs> I'm just like... I, I like to do the fresh ones, but... Yeah. Um, I mean, it's more satisfying to do the actual squeezing mm -hmm. of yes. the lime, for sure. Okay. Meant to be right. RV and said, I just love your thumbnail for this live stream. <laughs> Isn't it cute? It's super cute. Okay. One we more dip. We had to do something. Let's go. Let's try it. And then and then let's hope that this is I'm going to get like a, a big old piece of cilantro in my... I taste the lime now. Lemon yeah, question mark. That's really good. We're using lime. Lime juice. Lime juice. We squeezed two limes in, but it wasn't quite enough, so we just grabbed our lime juice out of the refrigerator. Okay. Yeah. All right, I think we're good Very with that. Nasty. Did you have your limes crossed? <laughs> yes, Ken, we had our limes crossed. I don't know what we oh were thinking. Oh, my gosh. Uh. <laughs> now you guys get to sit here and watch us eat guacamole. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. It's so good, you guys. It's mm. really good. Okay, so we have these beautiful mugs that Gary made. Yep. We're gonna go do our giveaway now. Woo! Okay. Um. So, to enter the giveaway, you were to be subscribed to Instagram and to uh, YouTube. Follow us on Instagram. Um, like and comment on that post. We had a we... post on Instagram. I've been looking at all the feeds, and everybody who made a comment uh, is entered to win. A lot of you just hit the like button. <laughs> you liked it a lot, but you didn't comment, even if you said hi. I would have put you in the drawing. K would have worked. K. K. Or a smiley face. Or She's even like, hey, or Kristen, even an avocado. Comment. You, you forgot to comment. I know. I was like, like Kristen, sorry. You can't be the guest of honor and not be entered in this drawing. <laughs> Quick, before we go live, I need you to go and comment. Um, so 26 of you commented on that. And so hopefully all 26 of you are And on there are live. all 26 that are subscribed to our channel currently. Yes. We checked and double checked to make sure everybody was subscribed. And... Um, can you so give us a close-up of the mugs? Yeah, yeah, sure. Let me get them up close there. There we go. So two different That's mugs. Cool. Yep. With our logo on it. One is of the Grand Canyon. That's the blue one here. And then this other one is Sunset here in Arizona, right? Yes. So that's oh gosh, the Sunset sunsets in Arizona. Here are beautiful. You can't go wrong with the sunsets out here. No, it's just second so to none. Pretty. And these are really nice mugs. And I love the black. Mm -hmm. It's just really good. It makes those pictures pop. Yep. I think you did a good job with them. He yeah. told me after work one day, hey, I ordered them. I ordered I ordered our grand prize. And I was like, oh, <laughs> what is it going to look like? It's like black <laughs> mug. And uh, yeah, I think it looked a lot better than I was hoping. Okay, so I'm going to do the honors, yeah? Yep, well, we should, so we have, we, we'll do the number, and then we'll make sure. Honor, do the number so everybody knows. Okay. Well, what um, if it's me? So we're using a <laughs> number <laughs> randomizer. A number randomizer. Ah. And um, so we do have a second prize and a third prize. Yes. Second prize is going to get an Amazon gift card, um, and we'll email that to you. Um, and then, uh, then we'll mail you a third sticker. prize, we're going to make our children sit down and, and draw you a picture. I meant Aww. for them to do that. Uh, before this drawing so we could show you. Um, I think we had to have go and have like a cookout next door. Right, yeah. So everybody <laughs> was busy today. Um, and because because I want every single one of our 26 entrants to have a chance at winning these beautiful mugs, we're going to draw first prize first. Woohoo! Because if you think about it, you draw third prize and second prize first, then those people are out of their draw out of the running, right? Yeah, exactly. And they don't get a chance for the mugs. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do first prize, second prize, and third prize, and um, and then we will get a hold of you and get your um, addresses to mail you your wonderful prizes. So, without further ado, what do I just shake it? Shake it. Do <laughs> hard. Shake it. Okay, there it goes. Oh. No, that we can't do that one. Yes, it can. <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> you mean? You think I jinxed it? <laughs> you want me to do it? I shouldn't have told you what number you were. <laughs> oh, no. You guys, you guys, she shook it, and it was twenty six. I think that was gonna happen. It's no like more magnet. <laughs> what? I will gladly take a cup, though. There you go. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I feel like we just totally. 
Holy. Okay, I'll shake Jim's the next one. It says, who wins the Grok, though? <laughs> Number six, the second prize, Only Adventure. You are winning the Amazon gift card. And finally, Woo-hoo! shake it again. Wait, all right, okay. let's see if they're on here. I can't shake my own number again, right? No, shake it harder. There you go. <laughs> Ten. <laughs> Learning as we're living is gonna Yay! get our kids artwork. Awesome. Congratulations! Well, I'm so funny. <laughs> what the first prize? Me oh my too. gosh! <laughs> we did, we did not so rig awesome. it. We promise. I swear it wasn't rigged. Look, that's why I was like, oh shoot, it's my number. Shake, shake. So this is the app. Hello. You shake it. <laughs> Twenty-five. Shake it. 18. Uh, is, uh, people so are questioning it. Was it was showing like. <laughs> Scam to the roof. It was oh, showing guys. like zero, and I shook it, and it went straight to 26. And I was like, oh, wait, no, 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 it's can't be there. I skipped it right. You put 26 <laughs> because she was the last one to comment on our post. <laughs> Don't feel bad. Well, it's See, totally random. You don't have to ship them now. Nope. I know. That's a good thing. And you've already got our, our stickers, so we don't yeah. have to send that to you. So awesome. All right. Um, we so will reach guys, out to um, Only Adventure. Adventure is second prize. Second. And number 10, Learning As We're Living is number three. Yeah, they like, didn't have the mail. <laughs> yes. <laughs> There's a few no people on here. Time, Christian. Yep, There's yep. A, few, a few people on here that we could have uh, just held on to them until we saw them. So that's really cool. You guys, this has been Yay. so much fun. Thank you guys so much. These are so awesome. And you guys have been awesome, like at supporting us and encouraging Aww. us along the way. Yes. So I'm glad they went to you. Well, I'm. But you guys, we're gonna have more drawings. I think I love this so much. We might start doing. Um, RV SWAT was saying. They oh do yeah, a we do. They do a monthly. Nice. Did you know? That's awesome. We need to like follow them more often, and maybe we'll yes. get free stuff. Yeah. That's oh. awesome. <laughs> Very cool. Can't the U.S. Postal Service got ripped off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Saving the government money. Or something. Well, I mean, Too they do. Funny. They deliver our packages everywhere. They gotta get paid for something, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Nurse now traveler said, "Awesome! Congrats, no ordinary path and diary of a family for not having to pay shipping." <laughs> Yay! Yay! We promise it wasn't rigged. It wasn't. We promise. <laughs> well, her, re- you- her reaction was key. <laughs> it was like, <laughs> no, 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 well, John will be happy Too to know funny. that you have won yes. him a couple of mugs. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to like... Can we can we interview yeah. you separately from John? Sure. Just for our last few minutes. And then we yeah. do have sure. we do have shout outs tonight. So we'll do awesome. shout outs as well. Because we've got some new subscribers. So Living Light of says, please put the mugs on your new store so we can buy them. Ooh, oh, yeah. okay. yes, we can. We will. We will put mugs on there once we get it. They, going. they, they will have to be uniquely different from these. So we'll have the only. <laughs> so I get these. the only ones like these. They are There's one of a kind. One of a. But we will do something just as just as nice. I can't yep. wait to sip some coffee outside. Oh my gosh! With these. Yes. <laughs> I'm so happy. You'll have to do an Instagram post Instagram and tag post. us. Yes, I totally will. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you guys. So good. Here, have yes. more. Okay. Eat in front of the camera. <laughs> <laughs> Don't make me look like, you know, it'll and make if, me not look so much like a pig. And again, if any of you guys <laughs> want one of our stickers, I'll go grab one, um, email us your <laughs> address and we will get that to you. Okay. So you guys decided to come back to Arizona. Mm-hmm. Why? <laughs> Because we hate the cold, <laughs> which is funny because we lived in Colorado for five years and we loved the snow there, but we do not love snow in an RV. It's and a little different. It is much different. And because we wanted different. to catch up, catch up with you guys. I and, know. You know, and some other like full-time families that are out here in Arizona. This is like the place to be in this in the winter. I almost said summer because it feels like summer. It does in feel the like winter summer. time. I don't know if I would want to be here in the summertime. <laughs> Uh, I don't no. think so. Not in an RV. Not I hear 120 thing. degrees in yeah, the no summertime. Thank you. No, no, no thanks. But <laughs> yeah, originally we wanted we wanted Hawaii. Um, that's what we were really shooting for, and it didn't work out this time. But you know, maybe ne- maybe next winter. But um, Phoenix was our backup plan, mm-hmm. and like when you say backup plan, it kind of sounds like a bad thing. But it, it's mm-hmm. it was they started to become more excited about coming back to Phoenix than possibly going to Hawaii, which is like kind of weird which is how we know that we were definitely meant to come back here right mm-hmm. exactly so, yeah 
Well, that's really good that you had a backup plan. So in this mm-hmm. lifestyle of, of, you know, where's the job going to come next? And you don't really know until yeah. like a couple weeks before you need that job. Yeah. And you're like. <laughs> it gets very so, stressful. <laughs> so it's good to have that backup plan and not to have your heart set on it. Because, I mean, at yeah. this point, we've never really had like, like we wanted somewhere in Texas, Texas, Tyler, Texas, we thought. And then we didn't yeah. hit there the first time. We were in Louisiana. And yeah. then we were thinking Santa Fe. Uh, New Mexico for a second like, one, <laughs> and we got, yeah. we got Amarillo, Texas. So our our recruiters doing pretty good at getting us in, in around that area, that area yeah. but yeah. um, but not so much like right where we had planned. That's yeah. happened to us too, for sure. Like when we um, we wanted we well we wanted we Reno when we got Reno, but then we just said Pacific Northwest basically, and we actually really wanted Spokane. Um, or Coeur d'Alene. Mm-hmm. And Those are beautiful. Places. Yeah, and then we got Seattle. Small. And they're small. Yeah, they are. And then we got Seattle, and we were just like, okay, cool. <laughs> we know people from there. Yeah. <laughs> Except that we weren't there. I know, right? We were in Texas. <laughs> I remember like messaging you guys like, where should I go to church, and where should I get this, and what's this area like, and this RV park. So that was I awesome. I thought it was just so funny because yeah. John got to experience working for my company. Yeah, I know. Not necessarily so the hospital I came from. I was I was at the small, small yeah. hospital. Um, yeah. In, but the in, same medical well, system. Well, now you're both working for the same hospital system right, again. exactly, exactly. But in different hospitals. I know, yeah. it's so weird. <laughs> we work for the same company. This, we have the same recruiter. And yeah. We both are working for Banner right now. Right. Uh, we've both worked for Multicare. It's just, it's it's a small world. It yeah, really it really is. So, so uh, traveling down in Bannister said uh, they want some of our guacamole. Oh. And we're trying to figure out how to get it. I'm like, I well, know. put the address in. Don't you to, wish you had smell vision Put the recipe. smell vision Because it smells really yeah. good. Mmm, <laughs> yes. I don't think that guac <laughs> ships, ships well. <laughs> <laughs> You get a little squishy. Just yeah. Get, I love the thing is, is like after guys, a day of in the air. I love how he's telling you guys while he's typing it in to put it on to the feed so you can yeah. read it. <laughs> well, you know, we're high tech here. That's how we roll. High tech, high tech. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, we need to all spend a summer in Alaska. Says mm-hmm. X marks oh, the spot. Oh yes. yes, I'm down for that actually. But I like. Could we all that. get jobs there, or are we just all gonna go I don't and think not work? The way the way their employment stuff know. works, you can't you can't be you can't work there for more than like thirty days without becoming a resident in Alaska. Oh, there's some oh, weird there's some weird laws that about that. How for travel nurses? I don't know. I think that's I mean Lisa's Lisa's mom's a, like a nurse up there, but I think she's. I a, know, but it's a long contract. It's for long, years. We yeah. talked about it like since we didn't get Hawaii, we we played with the idea of trying to do Alaska this summer. Mm-hmm. But I think it's too fast. Yeah. Like, we need yeah. more time. Yeah. So it would have to be next summer. Yeah. But as a travel nurse, it's difficult because, like, we have to get up there, and then we're in that one spot, and Alaska's huge. Yeah. So even is. if you yeah. get a whole week off, I don't know how far you can get to explore no. before you have to come back and work again. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's why we're contemplating just taking a month or two, and if financially visiting. feasible, yeah. to just go. And we don't want to... Like we we've seen people take their big rigs like our trailer up mm-hmm. there, mm-hmm. and it's just come back thrashed and needed to go oh, in the shop. So yeah. we're thinking about purchasing something smaller to Very live small. in, yep. like a, like a you know a pop up or a you know something like that. Yeah, that we can use just for that time and then get rid of. Yep. Yeah. Question so. for Kristen: uh-huh. Do yeah. you know where you are headed next from Living Light RV? Um, we know our area that we're shooting for is the Great Lakes area. Ooh. Yeah, so we want to be around somewhere around the Great Lakes for the summertime. So that contract would start like the beginning of May. And actually, funny you should ask, after that, we're planning on going to like way northeast and we want to cut up into Canada over there. Oh. But I don't know what part of Canada you guys are Hear from. Hear that? Canada, uh-huh. Yeah, in the week, but Canada. that would be later on um, this year. <clears throat> they're from Alberta, right? They're from Alberta. But they may not go all the way back to Alberta, depending. Depending, so. yeah. Can't Lisa? Is it gonna be Alberta or is it gonna be what Vancouver or BC somewhere? Yeah, something like that. Anyway, um, yeah, we want to go to Canada yeah. and visit them some summer when they have to be up there and they can't yeah. come. They can't come down. That would be fun. But maybe on our way to Alaska. <laughs> <laughs> so traveling down, Bannister said we could tra- you know, just transport the guacamole. You know, like Star Trek transport the guacamole I to them. Yeah, I have always as all you know since I was a kid, I was always like. 
I wish there was transporters. It would be so, like, it mm-hmm. took us 30 minutes to drive to church. Yeah, like, every time we're making this drive back, I'm like, can't we just teleport? That would be so awesome. I want it so bad! <laughs> just scramble my molecules and put me together I over know. there. This is a really nice yeah. spot to camp, but it yeah. is so far it from is everything. so far from So everything. far. For the yeah. most part, my happy place is when I'm driving. When you're driving? Yeah. It's just like, mm, I'm driving. He likes driving. I don't know. I like, it's why I do, it's a lot of, uh, like, thinking time. Yeah. 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 <laughs> um, so yeah, the living in is in western, from from Western Canada. Okay. And they're in BC on so until the road thaws even, out. Uh, <laughs> they can't go further into Alberta until the roads are roads are better. So they'll be in BC, and then by the time you're going up there, they'll probably be back back in Alberta. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Maybe you should go. I don't know. Maybe we can at. see. Yeah. I don't actually really know the geography of Canada that well, so I have no <laughs> idea where Alberta is. <laughs> We were not required to take Canadian geography no, in school. No, we weren't. I'm just going to come out and say it because it's better to just own it than to pretend like I know. Yep. <laughs> Thank you for joining Avenger RV Adventure. Thank Have you so night, much y'all. for entering our contest as well, and hopefully you'll win one of our future wins. I don't know if that'll work well. What? Kent said uh, Willy Wonka gum, guacamole flavor. Ooh. I, don't know I think gum, I though. like the textures. Only though. if I could sip a margarita at the same time. <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. Margarita gum with guacamole gum. Oh, I would do margarita gum. I'm not an know. alcoholic, I promise. <laughs> no. no, she doesn't go around with a martini in her, in her hand all day long. No. Thank you for joining our national adventure. Have it a good night. It sounds like people are having to hop off, and we are getting close to our hour mark. So yes. I'm going to go ahead and do our shout outs. For our newest defamers, um, unless you've subscribed during this live stream. And so our shout outs for this week are Imagine Your Odyssey, Crystal Pets, Lisa H, Jackie Hutton, Lee Van 221, Dwight Finistad, E Edmund 1, and Javi 1717 Ibarra. I don't know what it is with the numbers, but a lot of people put numbers in their names. I think yeah. it was their old IM handle. Could be. Oh. Could Throw be. back yeah. to the 2000s. Could be. <laughs> no, mine, was, mine was Ozland Cutie. Ooh. <laughs> Lightful Mind RV it's says, I think we're going to Banff someday soon. What? I want to go to Banff. Oh, Banff yeah. Banff is awesome. Yes. That would be awesome. Oh. I think when we end up going to um, to Alaska, we're definitely going to have to go kind of more east a little bit to mm-hmm. like Banff and some of those places. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Banff and Jasper. And Sorry, there's a little fuzzy floating around. At least it's not a fly. I mean, Go away. we should knock on wood. Well, actually, it's the nighttime. It's okay. Yeah. But yeah, they're all up on the roof. The middle of the day is awful here for flies. <laughs> it is. <laughs> We've had that conversation around our campfires a lot. Yeah. <laughs> yes, we, we shouted like, you out. Really imagine your day. odyssey. <laughs> hmm? Imagine your odyssey. You said, what? Yes. A shout out? Thanks. You're welcome. <laughs> You're welcome. You are so welcome. We have been doing shout outs since we've been at probably, what, 100? Since we've been doing live streams... Uh, on the road, I yes. think. Yeah, yeah, when we did our live streams we started in it, transition period, we weren't we weren't focusing so much on that. We started it while we were wintering. Hi, Mike. Mike. How are Mike. you? Mike. He says, hey, hey, hey. We Mike, miss you, you guys. Missed it. Thank you for the shout out, guys. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we do need the winners to somehow contact us, or um, we could try and we reach will out try to, to reach out to you as well. And again, those winners. Our prize winner right here. We promised it wasn't rigged. Oh, and then where's my others? Oh, only adventure. We're at one second place, and learning as we're living. Learning as we're living won our third place. So. Yep. All right, you guys. We, all, we almost got learning as we're living to join us this week out here. Ooh. Oh, really? But then they decided, oh, we'll go north. Oh. It's okay. They had they had change of plans. They've been out camping at. Uh, so it'll be fun trying to get something to them. <laughs> <laughs> if they travel every couple of days, like, how do you get something to yeah, them? Yeah. Mail okay. forwarding, probably. I'm mail yeah. forwarding, and it can sit there until they get it to them. Mike said, Mike O said they're almost ready for their channel. Oh, awesome. awesome. Well, when you're ready and you have questions, ask this guy. Yes. For sure. I'm super excited about there. Mary Lou Grabowski says, congratulations to all the winners. Yes. Well, you guys, thank you so much for joining us. This has been an amazing, epic adventure. Hey, you know what? I think, did we talk about everything here? Yeah, we did. We did. Yeah. It really has been an amazing year, you guys. Even just the month 
not even a month yet, into 2020. Mm -hmm. um, I feel like we've met so many awesome people. We've had so many great experiences. We have so many awesome plans for the future. And all of you are just supporting us so much. So we want to just say thank you from the bottom of our hearts. Yes. Let us know if there's anything that we can do for you um, because we're here for you as well. Especially this big guy if you're starting up your own YouTube channel. <laughs> all right, Garrett is Garrett is saying goodnight to everybody. Good night, everybody. Melanie, we love you too. Yay. We love you so much and we want to interview you soon. Yes. So... We will see you soon. Um, and if you're just joining late, we did make guacamole live. So rewatch it and see how we made super guacamole. It was yummy. It was um, bear with us as we're traveling from here to Texas. We'll try to do our regular schedule with a video on Wednesday and a live stream on Sunday. Although next Sunday, I think, is Super Bowl. So we'll see if Super Bowl is finished. Ooh. Oh, the Chiefs are playing in the Super Bowl. What? Yes. Is that your team? Well, that's where I'm from. Oh, awesome! <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not a sports fan, but I'm very excited about the Chiefs, the Kansas City Chiefs. Oh, well, there we go! It's something to look forward to for next Sunday. <laughs> Just don't break your mugs. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm really excited. You have to drink something out of your mugs during the football game. I hope you can, yes, totally. I hope you can watch it. I know, me too. I'm like, they've got to sign up. Watch this. Some, some sports bar. Yeah, we'll somewhere have to go somewhere watch. to watch it. I think we have to watch it just because it's very monumental. Like, they haven't been in the Super Bowl since the 60s. Oh, so, that's like, a long time. Our whole family is, like, you know, yeah. freaking it's out. It's nice over because it. it's two teams that are, have never really been there before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Patriots aren't there. Yeah. It's a throwback to when the the um, Seattle Seahawks go like, finally Scott's got to the, the playoffs. <laughs> yeah. Everybody, I mean, everybody. Uh, when the when the Mar uh, sorry the Seahawks made it to the Super Bowl, like uh -huh. everybody around us was just going nuts, and we're yeah. like, "Yay!" Mm. Good I know. For you. Fireworks that's, going that's off. Like, just... I'm not normally a. I mean, I don't. I know. Like, Go sports team! Yay! We don't. We but don't like watch it's contagious you know when your whole family is like, "Did you see the game? Did you see the game?" Like, Galleon Adventure said it was 50 Bowl. years. It's been 50, 50 years. years. Yeah. that's insane. It's been a long time. That's crazy. It has been crazy. Yeah. Uh, Grassroots Living says, "Go Chiefs!" Yay! <laughs> we'll we'll be reading rooting for the red team. <laughs> oh, thank you so much. Road tripping with go red uh, team. Go red team! Yay! Road tripping with Tecax is in here. I think I said their name right. Tecax. Okay. Road tripping with Tecax. Thank you so much. Yes, we are happy with our 1,000 subscribers. We're actually yes. at 1,040 or something like that. Woo! I know. Yeah, 1,045. It's 1, just going to start, it's it's just start like, getting traction now. Yeah. Well, I mean, we were like fighting like, to try and get like one more, one more, yeah, one more. And then all of a sudden that. it got over 1,000. We're like, look at it. Like, oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Yeah. Oh. We <laughs> got over 1,000. Awesome. The, the day we hit 1,000, I was at work and I was kind of bummed because. I had to work and like we couldn't just like go yeah. out and celebrate right then and there we had to plan a celebration yeah, so, yeah. it's been good though mm -hmm. you guys thank you so much for joining us thank you so much Kristen for joining thank us thank you I don't think that John has made it back yet <laughs> no he's so still be he'll have to come over and enjoy some of yeah. this guacamole with us yeah. yeah but anyway we look forward to talking with you all again and we have one more Grand Canyon video coming out so that stay tuned for that at 8 p.m. on Wednesday, Central Time, and we're going to kind of talk a little bit about why we went to the Grand Canyon. We showed our adventures, what we did while we were there, but we wanted to show, tell you a little bit more of behind the stories, behind the scenes of how why we got we went, there. How we got to the Grand Canyon. So, yep. stay tuned for that, you guys, and we're going to sign off, as, and as always, I think that's your line. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. There we go. And as always... Live, Live life, life intentionally. intentionally. <laughs> Bye, everybody.